Well, I first became aware of Hunter Syndrome when my wife, Haiyan Fu, started working for a laboratory at North Carolina that was specifically uh, engaged in research in Hunter Syndrome. We began working with that group and trying to develop therapies uh, specifically for that disease. Hunter Syndrome is a genetic disease with a single gene defect. The damage is very severe. However, we know what's caused the disease, and the genes caused the disease being identified. So the difficult part is, how do you get that gene in there? It's easy to clone the gene, to grow it, but how do you get it into the patient? But we've developed it to the point now where we can, uh, in the case of Hunter, uh, our plan is to do just a simple injection into the bloodstream. It appears that we can get it to go to many different uh, essential organs, and we can even get it to go to the brain. And that's been a real revolution for us. The Hunter community are our collaborators. Without them, this um, wouldn't be possible. We feel the inspiration from the kids and the parents, you know, driving us to continuously working on this, no matter how difficult it is. In spite of all the obstacles, it's worthwhile to pursue this. There are enzyme replacement therapies that help, but they don't address the neurodegeneration. And the neurodegeneration is what ultimately is robbing them of the lives that they really should have. It's working very well. It's a cure in the animal models. However, still back to the funding. And the funding is the biggest hurdle when you try to move forward for clinical trial. Our goal and the goal of all our collaborators is to treat uh, these patients with effective therapies and therefore we can further improve their quality of life and improve the quality of life of their families.